Uh, I always wish that a thing called Nodico would come up on the machine because that was a, something that only the officer of the watch could touch, but it never happened to me. But if it did, you had to stand up and call out Nodico and the um, officer watch would come and everything would stop and she'd decode the message. And um, But one day a girl said to me, look, I've got a very nice American boyfriend. She said, and he wants to know, would you like to come out with us? She said, Margaret, he's so interested in what I do and he's very interested in, the, you know, what the office looks like. The, and I said, well, the Aussie boys are good enough for me. And I worried I got to be and I couldn't think, or well, wonder what I should do. Should I tell them it is? And, and then all of, and I didn't sleep for two days, but thinking about it, thought I've got to do something. So she suddenly wasn't there. So I went over to the hospital and they said, no, she's not here. So when I came off the shift that night, I said, Madam, could I see you? And I waited till everyone was gone and um, the next shift were coming on, you see, so I had to be careful what I was saying and I told her the story. And uh, she'd, all, uh, she'd been posted. And that's all I ever knew. Now, my nephew is in ASIO. Well, he's only part-time now, but I was telling him one day and he said, do you ever think that they might have been checking up on you?